Hey, hi everyone. My name is Ashna and I'm a maintainer for Eraser and a software engineer at Microsoft. And today I'm going to be talking about Eraser and some of the things that we've been working on. So Eraser is a CNCF sandbox project and it's a tool to help you remove a list of non-running images from the nodes in your cluster. So I'm sure we've all had CVEs arising from old and stale images, and Eraser helps you address these images by a manual trigger or automated removal. And what distinguishes Eraser is the control it provides you over the removal. So you can customize it with things like a repeat period, excluding certain images and nodes from removal, and also having a pluggable scanner. So Eraser schedules Eraser pods on each node, and each of the pods aim to answer three questions. The first is what images are present on this node. Second is of those images which are not tied to a container that is currently running. And of those images which contain a known CVE, meaning we should remove it from our cluster. So this is a diagram of how Eraser works, and the top half is just the scheduling of er the Eraser pods. So Eraser creates a custom CRD or image job that runs to completion and schedules the Eraser pods on each node. And we'll take a look closer into what's happening on each in each of those pods. So our pod in is represented in the middle here, and each container is referencing those questions that we saw before. So the collector container is getting that list of images using the container runtime interface, and it's passing on that to the scanner container, which is scanning those images uh, for CVEs, and it's using Trivi to do that by default, but that's pluggable with different scanners. And then that, the results of that are passed to the remover container, which performs the removal, again, using the container runtime interface. So some of the recent features that we've worked on to make Eraser more user-friendly is um, adding custom runtime socket configurations, adding support for Trivi status filtering, so you don't have to target every image that Trivi finds a CVE in. You can make it more targeted to what you want to remove. And by refining the RBAC, we've also decreased the um, memory pod, the pod memory by almost 90%. Um, and that helped us address some out of memory issues that the eraser pod was seeing. Uh, we've also added support for custom pod labels and custom fields for the scanner volume mount. So this lets eraser run in air gapped cloud environments. Some things that we want to improve for the future is surface vulnerable images. Um, and this would make it easier to see which images Eraser actually removed. We also want to stagger the load on the cluster by running the jobs in waves. Um, we also want to add support for CRI pinned images since we want to be able to filter these in the removal. And also we want to better handle the resource cleanup on job completions. So that's a quick overview of Eraser, but um, if you want to learn more and see what Eraser can do for you, you can check out the Slack channel or the GitHub repo so we can answer questions and get some feedback. And if you want to contribute, you can check out the contributing guide. And finally, if you want to try Eraser with your own scanner instead of Trivi, you can check out the Eraser scanner template. Thank you.